several days ago when I was checking the historical source for my Asian firearms video. Surprisingly, there was an interesting thing which wasn't about the firearms or weapons information, but it got my attention. This is a number system. However, it was different from what we know. At the same time, it was documented in a dictionary from the Chinese Qing Dynasty. So we may reasonable infer that this number system was used 300 years ago, or even in more early years. And also, this number system may always be used as a kind of traditional number system until modern mass got popular in China and the modern science arrived from Europe in the late half of the 19th century. In fact, the traditional Chinese number system is a very profound research project. This area may include the history of the Buddhist wars like Na Yu Ta, which is from Buddhism. The traditional number system was always changing in the thousands of years, and even the earliest number system can be traced back to the Han Dynasty, like Shu Shu Ji Yi, which is a book documented the Chinese number system in the late part of the Han Dynasty from around 1800 years ago. Thus, in today's video, we can check the numbers in the Qing Dynasty according to this dictionary. Meanwhile, we also can see the translation of the Manchu language for this traditional number system in the Han Chinese language and culture. Compared with the numbers nowadays, some of these ancient number names are different from our modern number, but some of them are the same with the current international number system. First, let's go from the one. One is Yi in Han Chinese and um in Manchu. Then it's ten in Chinese, is Shi and Zhuan in Manchu. Hundred is Bai and Tangku. The explanation in the Manchu dictionary is Zhuan Su Seven Tang Gu Seven, which means 250 is 100. Next is 1000. In Chinese, it's Tian, and in Manchu, it's Ming An. Its explanation is that 100 is 1000. Next is Tumen and Wan. In Manchu and Han Chinese language, respectively, the Asian dictionary says that 10,000 is the one and two men. Then, next part, some combinations of numbers, like Shi Wan and Zhuan Tu Men is 100,000, Bai Wan and Tang Gu Tu Men is 1 million, Tian Wan and Ming An Tu Men is 10 million, Wan Wan and Tu Men Tu Men is 100 million. So far, these numbers are the same with the modern number system, and except the Wan Wan, it's very rare in the spoken Chinese. Other numbers still are used in the real life of the Chinese language. So now, this part of the numbers are the special part, and we almost can't meet them in the daily life. In order to make the numbers more intuitive, I will put the number ruler to mark those special numbers. Now, the first, Yi, Bunai. This number actually is a 100 million in the modern Chinese language and also is commonly used. But in the ancient time that this dictionary was made, this was explained thus meaning it's 10,000, 100,000, is Yi. But now the meaning in the modern Chinese language. Next, 10 Yi is equal 1 Zhao, such 10 Zhao is equal 1 Jing, Jirun, 10 Jing is equal 1 Zi, Dun Shun, 10 Zi is equal 1 Gai, Turbun, 10 Gai is equal 1 Rang, Chak Chin, 10 Rang is equal 1 Go, Chak Shun, 10 Go is equal 1 Jian, Dam Dan, 10 Jian is equal 1 Zheng, Ji Li, 10 Zheng, is equal one zai, mi shun, ten zai, is equal one ji, cha ta, ten ji, is equal one hong he sha, gang gi, ten hong he sha, is equal one a sung qi, jam li, ten a sung qi, is equal one na yu ta, 
，桑布利，吞那由他，那是一口万，不可思议。上面的，吞不可思议，那是一口万，无量数，不住巴扎。Due to the many traditional Chinese numbers related to the words of Buddhism, we can say the last five number words are polysyllables, but not the typical single syllable Chinese words. Okay, this is today's video. Hope you liked this video. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. See you next time. Bye.